Jackson Stroud with two hits on the night as Cedar Ridge wins over Hillside here. And Jackson, good to get a win here. I know it's been a, a tough campaign. You've had some close ones. Had a close mm -hmm. one last night against Chapel Hill, but nothing like winning, is it? Nothing. Um, tonight, the team really just had a lot of energy, and we were all there ready to play. And that showed from the time we took in and out from and to the time the last uh, pitch was thrown to Sam, and he hit the walk off. Yeah. Um, all together, we did well throughout the game, had a couple errors here and there, but in the end, we were able to pull through and get the win. It seems like Coach Frazier, and he tweets this almost every night, he wants a one-day-at-a-time approach yeah. for this team. Is that fair to say? He's very focused on win or lose. He's always talking about how whenever your head hits the pillow that night, you need to forget about the game, no matter if you won or lost. Mm -hmm. And the next day, you need to be ready to, uh, with a new mindset to play. Yeah. So as you get ready here for the last couple of weeks of the season, you get Southern next week, what's the goal now for over the last couple of weeks? Just to stay focused and keep our energy up. Um, Coach is big on keeping energy high because whenever your energy's high, everybody's more focused and into the game. And it's just easier to um, prevent errors and stuff like that whenever everybody has high energy. Well, I know it's going to be a priority. There's still an outside chance Cedar Ridge can make the playoffs because right mm -hmm. now there's a log jam at the top half of the Cedar, of the uh, Big Eight. So it's a nightly event, really, yeah. watching the standings because look what happened Tuesday with Northern Durham and Chapel Hill. Oh, yeah. And, of course, mm -hmm. you beat Chapel Hill earlier this year. Yeah, we did. Um, so I'd say we have a chance. Just it's going to take a lot of hard work and determination to see it through. Absolutely. He'll start next week against Southern Jackson. Thank you. Thank you.